this is a little lesson or exercise using dire wolf. So, this is uh, not a note for note what Jerry played. There are plenty of videos that give you that um, kind of lesson where, you know, whatever he's playing, exactly. But this is more of a breakdown of things that you can play to it without being locked in to exactly, oh, well, I gotta learn note for note or else I can't play this. Instead, let's figure out, you know, what you can play. So, it's a very bluegrassy song right off the bat, and Jerry loved to use these bluegrass riffs, and I think it sounds pretty good with this. For instance, whenever you go down to this G, and a lot of this will be assuming you kind of know the chord structure to this song. Starting with a C. So you go down to this G, and this is classic riff where you're using this B flat and going up to the B. So that you got this major G, but you're bringing that bluesy third, dropping the third. So you got that, you're like halfway to the, maybe a third to the rest of the song. And same with the C. Um, or the F, actually, because... So that riff is basically all... Going up here to the B flat, and down to the A. And all of this is based on that G major pentatonic, which is an E minor pentatonic. And you add this so you're using that in obvious and so all those are the same notes except you're using it in a G and um, that's what gives it that blue grassy <clears throat> so that's what you're doing on the G. That's just a pull off off the C, off the E. And now you go to right to the F. Or I'm sorry, you go to this B flat. And here I play this. I kind of don't play the bass note just because I want to go. I guess you could kind of, but it's so passing. So then you're to the F, and sometimes I pull that little D note in there. And then you're doing the same thing within the F chord, where you... Playing this F, playing this um, A flat to the A. Or it could be like that run. G, A flat, A. That's a perfect one to give it a little. Because in this song, of, it's basically in C, or I'm sorry, yeah, C, yeah, whatever. That, that's a good note there, cause, third, E, E flat. Gives it a good. So anyway, back to F. So you're gonna G.
sometimes I'll play a... And then maybe bring the G up here. And play that same riff using the same... Now we're to the C. E, B, seven, A minor. And then G, F. So, then it keeps going. You kind of use the same, um, you know, the same feel as you go to the A minor. Last thing I want to say is once you start, I know last videos I've been messing with up the neck, go find other chords now, now that you got this. Now find it somewhere else, like up here, you're starting in the C and start. Now I'm using that C shape for my uh, G. So there you're playing that G. And then you go one half step down, and then you go another half step down. So. Just playing around with that, this shape. start actually soloing using chords oh sorry that uh, helps out a little bit on you know your quest for learning how to play this thing all right take her easy